Hello 3D printer peeps. Hello Bamboo Lab P1P owners and why not X1C owners and P1S owners as well. I'm sitting here next to my P1P and today we are going to test out something fun. This is an abrasive filament. This is glow in the dark. Now it's not a brand you are familiar with. I went with an unusual brand I never heard of. It's called XZN. And the reason is because there's a lot of cool colors out there made by companies you've never heard of. I believe a lot of these companies make these cool colors because it's difficult to compete in the basics such as white or black. So they make fancy colors that stand out. Now there are larger companies that also make glow in the dark filament, but we're not going to work with that today. We're going to work with this XZN filament and we're going to see how it goes. Now this is an abrasive filament, so I do have the hardened steel gear upgrade and the hardened steel nozzle upgrade on this P1P to help me handle the job without wearing out my poor nozzle. Let's open this thing up and see what it looks like. It's a good quality box, which is not something to take for granted. Inside is the spool. And what's this? Oh, we have a bonus item. It looks like they included a Ziploc bag to store the filament when you're done printing with it. Very cool. And I do believe this is the first time a filament has come with a bag like this for me. The spool itself actually looks really nice. It has a very professionally printed label. It has their brand name, which is XZN, whatever that means. It tells me it's PLA in very clear writing, as well as the color, which is glow in the dark, the size of the spool, a few of the characteristics of the filament, which it claims is bubble free, clog free, and tangle free. So, Kudos to you, XZN, so far so good. On the other side is a very cool note that's asking you to take the end of your filament when you're done and stick it in one of the holes so that it doesn't tangle. This is an awesome tip and I'm happy they put this on the spool. At the bottom, they actually have an Instagram and an email contact information. Very impressed for a brand I never heard of. I thought I was just getting some cheap whatever the heck and gonna throw it in my printer and hope for the best. But so far, I'm starting to feel good about this. That said, this is the mask we're gonna be printing. It is a standard ghost face mask. And we're gonna find out what's your favorite scary movie. And hopefully make this thing glow in the dark. Let's get started. And here it is. It printed absolutely flawless. Glow in the dark, ghost face. I guess we can call it glow face. Let's turn off the light and see what it looks like. And there it is, awesomely glowing in the dark. XZN glow in the dark PLA filament printed on a Bamboo Lab P1P with the hardened steel gear upgrade and the hardened steel nozzle upgrade. Your regular P1P should handle this as well. However, it may wear out your nozzle faster. You are on the 3D Rundown YouTube channel. I'm Greg Adventure, your instructor on 3drundown.com and testing abrasive glow-in-the-dark filament on the Bamboo Lab P1P was today's adventure. 